Good morning. This is one of those uh, games that it has crazy moves. Lots of blunders everywhere, but uh, there is a beautiful mid at the end. And I think you should find it interesting, at least at the end, not in the beginning. In the beginning, lots of blunders. So let's get a move on. Now, this is a very interesting move. Usually, the bishop just go over into this square. So, this is a very aggressive move right here. Let's get a move on. And that's, of course, a free pawn. And rook will go here after that one. So, let's keep going. This move is not a very effective move, basically, but what I, I did that just to annoy black, basically. So annoying the other person is a legitimate move. So that's, that's why I did it. And you can see so many uh, blunders question marks are there, double question marks. So yeah, not a very good thing to do. And this is a very interesting to do right here. You see, the bishop is protected by the knight and I have a rook just traveling along to the other side. And you would think that this will be protected, but just take the bishop and take the knight. So basically it's rook traded for knights and bishop. Uh, rook is five points, bishop and knights are like six points. So I gain one point over there. But people don't usually do that because remember uh, I gain basically uh, minus pieces against a rook and if you cannot coordinate the two minor pieces right here you're going to get in trouble. I have no problem doing it this time because I have two pawns against one pawn over there. So let's get a move on. You can see the computer over here suggested to move this point right here, connecting the knight. Basically have a that connection right there. But of course, I didn't do that. So let's get a move on. And this is a useless move because the net is protected with this one. Unless you want to take that one over there. But of course, this one is being threatened. The rook is being threatened. And Suddenly it's connected. Now, this one is a blocking position. Suddenly the, the queen move becomes useless. Let's get a move on. This is a very defensive move by black. Right away, you can tell that queen and rook is basically putting a force on this one. The bishop cannot do anything over here. Uh, the rook cannot go do anything over there because the knights will take the rook, basically. So, yes, this is basically a defensive move right here. And that's a good play by black, basically. However, if you look at the scoring here, what is winning? What is in great position right now? Not to say I know what to do, but what is winning? Let's get a move on. Exchanging the rooks is a time honored tradition in order to ease the pressure and away 
once the rook is gone, like it's basically two knights versus one rook, and like I said, it's very difficult to coordinate two many pieces together. Also, notice over here. So, uh, suddenly, the bishop can engage in a defensive position right here. So, let's get a move on. And that's an interesting move. I mean, I can basically just leave it over there. Uh, the rook is threatening to take that pawn, and bishop here can actually activate somehow. But I just did that. So let's get a move on. Trying to trade queens, basically. Rejected. Notice the arrow over here by the computer. That's how you can get away from mate. Uh, I mean, this is check. That's a losing move because checkmate is now unavoidable. So, yes, that's a mate. But over here, it's not winning either. I did some analysis to it, and it's extremely difficult to have a decisive win, but it is losing. So. Let's get a move on. And this is the mid that and I did find the mid because over here you can see the king can take the knight. In fact the king has to take the knight because there's no other way to go. The queen has taken all the effort by escape so the king will take the knight. And finally the bishop can uh, attack the king. Now, the bishop cannot block the attack because bishop goes here, bishop takes bishop and mate king. Pawn is taken over here and the knight is taken over there. So there's only one move available over here. And that's it right there and checkmate. That's a beautiful mate right there. The beginning is chaotic, but that's the way I like it. So, thank you for watching, and we'll see you tomorrow.